Hey guys, Dan Tope here from Detope Knives. Uh, we are actually sitting in the Detope Knives uh, knife shop right now, and I want to talk to you about the new Bravo Tope Recon. Uh, this is the Jenna Martin designed sheath that it comes with, and let me show you the knife. This is one of the Bravo series. Uh, I approached Mike Stewart on the uh, doing some design stuff for him on the Bravo series, and uh, was honored that he that he said yes. So what we did was uh, we took the new signature Bravo handle for the larger Bravos. It's on the Bravo machete. I believe it's going to be on the Bravo three and all of the larger Bravos. Uh, put some taupe flare to it with the harpoon, a uh, little bit taller blade. Uh, we did some jimping back here and an extra lanyard hole. Um, we also did uh, the signature Bravo ramped version. This is the field version. Um, what I had in mind when the blade was designed on this was uh, wanted a little bit taller blade, wanted to be able to do field tasks, uh, camping chores, things like that, and then also have it to be a military style knife as well. Because uh, that's what the original Bravo was designed for. So, just trying to give you guys some angles of this. Uh, very comfortable handle. Uh, this is 3 16 CPM 3V, so it's nice and light. Um, and that's what we were going for. It's balanced just forward of the Ricasso area, so you can do some light chopping with it. And, uh, like I said, it's also nice and light for uh, slicing tasks and things like that. And it has that signature uh, signature Bark River convex grind, which everybody knows those are super sharp. Uh, a little bit about the sheath, Skin Bender, uh, Jenna Martin, who's the owner of Skin Bender, uh, designed this ambidextrous sheath. Uh, also has scout carry, and you can switch these scout straps around to be ambidextrous in that position as well. Um, pretty much all I have to say about the knife, really, uh, just also wanted to add too that, that, that it's an honor to be able to put my name on uh, one of the Bravo series. Uh, Mike Stewart said that he's basically up to this point been the only one that's ever designed a Bravo for the Bravo series, so I'm pretty stoked about that. Hey guys, I know a lot of you are waiting for Bulldogs. They'll be coming out soon. Uh, also, thanks for uh, following what I do and checking everything out, and make sure you check these out on DLT. Thank you.